Good morning. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is Monday the 5th of June and I'm heading off on a press trip this morning. I'm ready early for once in my life. Like I'm never ready early, especially when it's an early pickup. So it's like eight o'clock now and I'm being picked up in 15 minutes. I haven't checked in since I did my, or I shared my vlog of the first trimester and it was so nice that so many people resonated with what I was sharing because I was really nervous to share it, you know, and it was like really personal and I feel like I was quite vulnerable in it. But I'm so glad I did because other people told me they felt the same. So I was like, oh God, that's great. I'm not going crazy. Um, but I haven't actually vlogged since. I went through my camera. The last time I vlogged on this camera was while I was pregnant, but not telling anyone. I was trying to do a normal vlog, but it just became too hard because I was like, I'm just... I have to like cut so much out and I have to like lie about things. I was like, no, we'll just not vlog this. But um, today I can get back to normal. I can kind of fill you in a little bit on how I'm feeling and I'm going on a really exciting trip. I'm going to the south of France with Lancome and it sounds like it's going to be an amazing trip. So we go today, which is Monday, until Thursday and they have like a jam-packed itinerary of things that we're doing. We have like a couple of really nice evening events, like a gala ball is one of them, like a black tie thing, which I've never been to anything like that with a brand. So it should be really, really cool. And there'll be loads to kind of show you. Just having a coffee before I go, but I want to show you because I I turn 19 weeks this week and I think I'm starting to get a bump. Yay, finally. I know it's like, it's still small, but like, it's like, like this is like really hard and it's starting to fill out up here too. Hello, okay, so we've made it to our hotel and guys, you're not gonna believe this. It is absolutely pouring rain outside. Oh my God, it's so wet. But it, this is a very cool hotel. It's like, they're all little individual houses almost. So we got a golf cart down and this is like the living area. I see there's a bottle of champagne here that's gonna go to waste. <laughs> and they have this little setup. I'll show you. How cute. What's in here? It's our agenda for the, for the couple of days. And then this is the bedroom in here. Look at these pillowcases, gorgeous. And then we've got the wardrobe and bathroom, uh, complete with some gorgeous Lancome products. Look at this fruit platter they have. And I just looked at the wine as well. And it's alcohol free. How thoughtful is that? We're definitely off to a good start here. <laughs> okay, this is the outfit. I've got a white bodysuit, striped jumper, and these kind of linen trousers with the brown belt. And I'm off to the Villa Absolute for the introduction to longevity. It's just kind of like an intro arrival kind of a speech. So I'm about to do a skin screening, like a skin diagnosis. Look at this setup. So we've got all the Lancome products, Lancome and Absolute products. And we're about to get started. Is dehydrated? Mm. Yes. Okay. Yeah. We're about to see my skin in 15 years. Which this is, is today. Uh, today and in 15 years. Oh, that's not bad. 15 years. Oh, that's not bad. No, it's okay. That would be worse, yeah. <laughs> for 
tonight. It's for like the cocktail reception, the welcome cocktail. I had to do kind of a change of plan outfit wise because it's raining and my other dress was like way more summery. This dress I love though. I feel like it's perfect. It like matches the packaging very well. having a moment with the lights. It's one of these like tap on things and I keep like turning them all on and off. I'm just trying to get these lights on. Why does this always happen to me in every hotel room? But I'm just back in the room and I am so excited to get into bed. We had a lovely night. It was, a, it was like a cocktail kind of welcome party. They had loads of drinks, loads of different snacks and kind of starters and nibbles and yeah, it was just a lovely, lovely night. A lovely welcome. I'm pretty tired now, I'm not gonna lie. Didn't sleep that well last night. Worrying about just getting, did I have everything packed and organized for today? So I'm gonna sleep like a baby tonight. Okay, the best time of the day has come. Face mask, TV in bed. I found ITV2, which is playing the new Love Island. I'm so happy. Good morning, guys. Look at this setup for breakfast. The sun is shining. And I am so happy. Yum. I'm gonna show you, I just did my skincare, I recorded it on my phone, so I'm just gonna talk you through what I used. First up, the Absolute Gel Cleanser. Then I went in with the serum after that. Did a little bit of jade rolling. And then there's another tool here as well. So I think this one is probably for your eyes. It's, they're both like really cold, so it's so refreshing on your skin. So I did some eye cream for this. This is the revitalizing eye cream. And then I went in with the absolute light cream. This, guys, this smells like, honestly, amazing. I'll just show you like the texture. Oh my gosh, it's unbelievable. So we're gonna learn all about like how they make these products today. So sorry, I finished off with the absolute SPF 50. This is the global youth pro Global Youth Protecting Care. So I always wear SPF and this is a really nice light one. So yeah, with that being said, I'm gonna go and finish getting ready. And I'm just so excited for today. I, I like no idea kind of what's in store. Okay, I'm ready. I'm going to go for a walk, but I just wanna show you um, some of the Lancome bits, the makeup bits that I use before I leave. This is outfit number one of the day. This is just my walking outfit. <laughs> um, but I used the Lancome Tint Ideal Ultra Wear. This is shade 355N. It's a nice kind of dark tone if you have tan on, which I do. And then this lipstick 274 French Tea, it's called. It's a really nice kind of blushy red, reddy pink. It's a bit darker than I normally wear, and I think it's really nice. Um, it's a very French, and this smells unreal randomly. And sorry, I just love the packaging. So this is how it comes when you... Okay, and then the last thing I used was the, the Lancome Hypnose Mascara, which is amazing. It's dead. It's like my favorite mascara. Um, so yeah, I didn't want to put on too much makeup because we're probably getting some sort of a facial or a treatment later. But I'm going to go for a walk now and just explore the resort a little bit because it's so nice out. insane thing I have ever seen. There's a pool, there's gardens down there, there's like a million different rooms that are just so bright. The view, it's just insane. The pool, I'm like, can you imagine living here or like having a party here for one day even? It's insane. Thank you. 
making my way back to the room now. I have the gala ball tonight. We are gonna go back now and just start to get ready. I think it's gonna be amazing. Like everybody's really pulled out all the stops with their outfits so far. It's gonna be cool to see what everyone is wearing later. God, it's such a nice day here today. Okay guys, I'm in the middle of getting ready and there was a beetle on the wall a minute ago and now I don't know where it is. So that's worrying, but <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm gonna show you my dress. I think I'm nearly ready now. So tonight is a gala dinner, so it's black tie. Uh, I'm wearing the same lip lipstick as earlier on my lips and yeah, I'm all dressed up. So we you see the dress, it's so fancy. We're going to a chateau, so I feel like it's appropriate for where we're going. Can you see the dress properly? I love it. And it's got pockets. Earrings are crystals and co. So sparkly to match the dress. I'm just back in the room. My battery on my camera died quite early, so I didn't get like a lot on my camera. I'm just recording this on my phone now. It is like 12, yeah, near close to 12 anyway. I'm so tired. I cannot wait to unzip this dress <laughs> and get into bed and take off my makeup. But it was such a gorgeous night. I will put in some pictures and videos. But we arrived, it was at this gorgeous chateau in the mountains and they had a guy on the piano who could play every song you can imagine like the like real modern songs like he was playing like uh Dua Lipa at one point he played some Dr Dre he was playing like all just really cool music on the piano um there was just a gorgeous view of the south of France I like I was fascinated looking at what everyone was wearing and we went into the chateau which was stunning it was like literally could have been Versailles and had a really nice candlelit dinner and then came back. Gorgeous, gorgeous day and tomorrow we've got a really busy day. We are heading to the Demain de la Rose. We're gonna learn about the ingredients in the absolute products. It's about the rose, that's like the iconic rose to do with Lancome. We're gonna walk through the rose gardens. It's gonna be busy so, and we're, we're actually leaving like 8.45 in the morning. So I'm gonna go take off my makeup and get ready for bed. Yeah, what a day. Good morning, it's Wednesday. We are off to Demain, 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 De La Rose today. I am just up, I got some breakfast in the room and I had a coffee in bed. It is half eight now. I'm wearing this set from Dish, it's like a nice linen set. I'll take you along and I'll show you what the villa looks like. It's supposed to be amazing. It's supposed to be this like pink building. Everything is pink to represent the Lancome Rose. So I'm very excited to see it. They weren't lying when they said it was pink. How gorgeous. Okay, now we are going in to do a house tour. We do see this house, like everything is pink. Everything. Even the toilets. and gather the ingredients. Okay, I'm just stepping out here to the rose garden. It's so cool, they were saying there in the distillery that they actually create the roses, like themselves. They take the pollen from one rose and put it into the pollen part of the other rose. Sorry, my, I'm not completely familiar with all the, the terms. But then like over time, these create like brand new roses, brand new scents, colors, and it's so cool. I did not know that you could do that and it's obviously it's done naturally by nature the bees and stuff do that but they've Lancome have actually done it themselves and some of the roses in there have taken like over 10 years to create and there's just so much research and everything that's gone into their products I'm so impressed with how conscious they are to be sustainable and to be eco-friendly this whole farm is all like there's no fertilizer on anything everything is super organic and natural and you know just good for the environment so yeah I'm very very impressed with this farm all the 
tents are like press offices during the camp and film festival which actually wasn't that long ago and there are like some of the movies actually get little spaces here and they have pre-drinks here before the festival and I think we're going up here where that's where the can film festival steps are so I'll take you over there so these are the actual steps that you see in all the pictures from the camp film festival it looks like they're still taking things down from the festival how cool though I feel like these steps are so iconic hello the tiredness is very real came back from Cannes, which was amazing to see. By the way, it was really nice that we went in there for lunch because that wasn't actually supposed to be the original plan. And just like seeing where they have the Cannes Film Festival and stuff, very cool. But um, came back, did a bit of work on my laptop. I probably should have napped, but I didn't. We are just going for dinner now. It's a quiet dinner tonight. It's just the Irish crew, so just three of us. And then we head back tomorrow because it's only, it's the only day tomorrow is the only day there's a direct flight from here. So it's great we get an, another night here while it's kind of quiet. So I reckon tonight will be an early night. I'm exhausted. It's been an amazing trip, but you know, it has been busy. There's been lots of different bits on. Tonight I'm wearing this ASOS dress and it is like super flowy and comfy. And it's actually a top shop from ASOS dress. I'm wearing flats to give my feet a little bit of a break, but we're going for dinner just in the hotel. And I will bring you along and show you what the food looks like. It's supposed to be really nice here. I'm home. I'm back in my robe. I am exhausted. It's 11 o'clock. I'm only in the door about 15 minutes. Oh, um, I'm on FaceTime to Mark, but he has left the room. He is writing his speech for his brother's wedding, which is next weekend, pretty soon. But um, we had a lovely meal tonight, just the Irish crew. And we are heading home tomorrow. We have until midday here. I'm gonna get some work done in the morning. Oh, Mark's back. Say hello to my vlog. Hello. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go take my makeup off. I'm going to get into bed. And yeah, I'll check in with you in the morning. Last morning of delicious room service, even though it's the same thing I eat at home anyway. I got some cocoa pops and I got a yogurt, orange juice, and they actually sent me bread as well and some coffee. I am by the pool. I said I would make the most of the last hour here. And the pool, oh my god. It's overlooking like the hills. You can see all the houses. The pool is like so peaceful and quiet. I got an iced coffee. I got a bag of water. I love the way they do that. They did that when we were in Bordeaux last year too. They give you these little ice bags. But last year there was wine in it. This year, just water. Hello, I am home. I am unpacked. I have had my dinner. Mark met me downstairs, helped me with my bags. Got a Chinese, had a Chinese waiting for when I came in. And then we went to the park and played with Cooper. So, oh, there he is. So I'm very happy to be home. I'm exhausted, I'm exhausted. So I am going to, I've actually a bit of work to do now, but I'm gonna go take off my makeup, get into PJs and have an early night tonight. It's been such an amazing few days. Like I'm so, so grateful to have gone and so grateful to Lancome for inviting me and just had an amazing, amazing time. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog and I will pick back up again soon, maybe fill you in on a little bit more of normal life because the last couple of days were definitely not normal. Hopefully it's still really enjoyable though to watch and thank you so much for tuning back in. I'll see you all soon. Actually, before we go, update kind of getting bigger. This dress really shows it off well. <laughs> okay, bye.